25 up to 25 years old for women, 30 years old for men, says she's doing this to keep her guests safe. This move follows an incident outside the lounge and, of course, the deadly mass shooting now almost two weeks ago in Five Point South. Your reporter, Bria Chapman, is live at 5 and on your side after this decision from Desire Bar and Lounge in Avondale. Yeah, that's right, Sarah. So I spoke to Mimi Williams, who co-owns Desire right here in Avondale, and she tells me she hosted an alumni event last week, and everything was going smoothly until the younger crowd arrived, and then she says things took a different turn. At one point, they were standing all in our chairs on the patio, sneaking bottles in, kept trying to smoke um, marijuana weed in here. And um, so we turned we turned it down and went straight blues. So they started walking out, but the crowd was still standing right outside our door. And while they were outside, Desire owners Mimi Williams and Mario Billingsley say a fight broke out right outside their doors between a young woman and another man. And I just saw a young lady just beating on her boyfriend. And when I tried to tell her, baby, calm down before you go to jail, and she just told me, I don't give a and then punched me and my arm still is bruised now so that young woman was arrested but after that encounter and the mass shooting in five points south william said something had to change that played a big part in it um i'm still dealing with those issues our daughter was in that um in hush when it happened she was knocked out it's something williams still struggles to talk about but billingsley says both incidents played a role in the choice they made to change the age limit now it's, some of this is, is a part of the business but we we taking these steps to uh try to we're going to protect our brand i just want to keep our customers here safe happy and having a good time and this, we are family here, and we, we treat everybody like family here. And we want to keep it that way and keep it safe for all our customers. And yeah, Desire will open here in Avondale in about an hour. And if you meet those age requirements, they want to see you. Now, the owners tell me, though, if they continue to have issues, even with these new changes, they will increase that age limit even more and make it 30 across the board for men and women. Your reporter last night in Avondale, I'm Bria Chapman, WBRC 6 News on your side. Bria. I know mornings are hard. People don't. Now. You all saw that. First and foremost, all you saw was pure Keisha energy. Starting with the reporter. She was just doing her job, so we'll give her a break. But um gonna raise the minimum age to thirty for men, twenty-five for women. Uh listening to the owner of the bar, it sounded like the woman who punched her was probably around twenty-five, so she thinks that 25 uh, the Scraggle is going to have some intelligence and maturity. And actually, the age limit should be raised to probably 35 or 40 for men and then probably 35 for women. And even that's no guarantee when you're dealing with chimps, <clears throat> a.k.a. niggas. Know, this is why you think about it, there are very few really good nightclubs in a lot of these big cities. And if there are, what few there are, they're either so expensive and they do that deliberately to keep the knuckleheads out, the chimps and the chimpettes out, or they just bother, they just close up. Now, I know there's somebody that's going to be saying, well, they hear that in the white nightclubs. They be fighting in the white nightclubs. Fuck you. Odds are you've never even been in a fucking white nightclub. But I'll tell you this. The ones I've been in, the very rare times someone has acted up, they get them out like that. Whether it's a, a regular nightclub playing, you know, traditional music such as were or even the country and western clubs they ain't having it 
And uh, jumping into this thing where they talked about the mass shooting that happened in a different location. The shit wasn't a mass shooting. It was just some niggas going wild and cutting loose with some damn machine guns. Said it before. 